Alright, I'm back. More of The Walking Dead. Yeah, man, if y'all are liking these videos, y'all like this, this, this game, watching me play this game, remember to like, comment, so I can see that you guys actually like and support it. Yeah, man. Alright. Let's just start then. Let's go get Kenny. You need to stop the train. Oh, it's over. Just, just let, let the kid go. <sighs> Kenny, what? Ken, what the hell's that? His blood. Your son's blood. Get out of here, Ken. You know he's dying. Nobody knows shit. He'll be fine. <sighs> Wake the fuck up, man. This is over. He's dead. Don't you tell me. I got a real family I'm trying to protect. Not that fucking sham you're running back there. What the fuck you talking about? They're not good, bro. Holy lucky I can't punch him. That's what I figured. Oh, I think he's a big tough deal? man. He's a little sick, but we can't just quit. It's a scratch. He's not like the others. Jesus, all y'all are just making it worse. Stop the train. Stop it, goddammit! Fuck you. you. Made it quicker? Listen, for what? Bro, your kids in the back dying. Knock this shit off. So, you wanna fight then? I'll beat the brakes off you, bro. I just wanna talk, kid. Relax. And talk. Whoa, I can't say that. You think you're the reason Duck was bit? Like you had this coming or something? You didn't kill Herschel's son. Yes, I did. And now it's catching up to me. That's not what went down. Bro, that's you just the order in nature. You can't stop Bad stuff that's meant to happen. Someone else's. There ain't no way this world lets my son live and I help put someone else's in the ground. That's not the way it works. Stop the train. That was good reassurance, man. See, not everything got to be got to be got to be fixed or with these hands. You could also talk your way to doing it. See, now he thinks of me as a better man. I could learn some things, but I would put them hands on him if he really did want to, though. It'd be bad for him. You better get running. On the fence out there, the homeless man and, and Ben. Ken, it's. I think it's time. D would y'all kill him or y'all leave him? The boy's been bit. In case you haven't figured that out. <sighs> He's a thug, he ain't. Take as long as you need. There ain't no time left to take. Yeah, we'll be here waiting. What are we gonna do? Damn. You can't allow him to become one of those things. But what if, what if he doesn't? Ken, I love you very much. I love our son more than life itself. I need you to hear me. What you are saying, that he may not turn, is foolish. But no. There's... Come on, Cat. If you think of one, you let me know. Isn't there some sort of pill or something we can just give him? Stop it. Just drift off to sleep. Right, hon? I mean, Jesus, this is our son. I know. But we know it's here or nothing. Fuck. Just who, then? You want me to? You don't have to. I'll do it. No, you don't have to. You want me to do it? No. It should be apparent. No parent should have to do something like this. That's, a, that's true. We can say our goodbyes and y'all can't put a bullet through your own kid. I don't know. If you leave, you'd be doing this family a great service. Why don't we take him into the forest so Clementine doesn't have to see? Yeah, it's a good, it's a good yeah. thought process. Give us a moment to say goodbye. Of course. Or y'all could just leave him.
much as he was annoying, it's, it's sad to see a little kid die, though. Damn, he was just my Robin, too. And he thought we were awesome. That's that's sad. What's happening? <sighs> Duck is dying. I know. What are you doing? I'm gonna make sure he's okay. But how? He's bitten. By making sure he doesn't come back. Oh. Look, Clint. Things are... What oh. the... No! Ben, take Clementine into the train. Go. It'll be fine. No. Popped him. Lily. Let me find out. No, bro, everyone's just gotcha. dying. Gotcha. Why, cat? Why? Oh, fucking god. <laughs> no, bro. What the Bro, we lost like one person in t 11 parts, and in these last two, four people done died. This is crazy. Sure you, you sure you up for it, bro? I'm official with it. Uh, that's insane, though. Damn, Doug. <sighs> R.I.P. Duck and Katja. Whatever, however you say her name, though. R.I.P. both of them. R.I.P. Carly. R.I.P. Mark, I think was his name. Got eaten. By people. Damn. Who else? Who else died? Oh, R.I.P. Doug. We lost a bunch of people, damn. This ain't no one left, basically. Four of us. Chuck said. What Chuck said? That what happened to Duck would happen to me. The fuck he did. I swear. I'm sorry. He said that? To... Don't be mad. No, I'm gonna whoop his ass. He's getting off. Hey. How you doing? Say what you said to me, asshole. Huh? Don't talk to my girl. Just stay away from her. Son. I heard you told her she was gonna die. That she was gonna end up like Duck. Why'd you go and do that? Because she is. The fuck? I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow that y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do you know? I promise you she will. I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. 
We get to Savannah, and then what? We do what's best for Clementine. Oh, well then, you do have it all figured out. Never mind. Look, sit down with the girl and hash it out. Find a map, for Christ's sake. I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you... Yeah, well, fuck all that, but it's still it not the place. It's still not your place. It's ain't nothing like that. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. She's a little girl. And she'll die a little girl if you treat her like one. You gotta consider her a living person. That's it. You're either living or you're not. You ain't little, you ain't a girl, you ain't a boy. You ain't strong or smart. You're alive. Look at her hair. You got her running around with a mop that's gonna act like Velcro to any hand swinging its way. Find some scissors in my pack and take care of that hair before Walker does it for you. And then show her how to use a gun. Because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. <sighs> I don't mean to tell you how to do your job. But too many people have died already. Not wrong. And seeing another little girl die might just do me in. I hear you. Plan, a haircut, and a gun. It's good advice. It's something. You have any family? Out there, somewhere. Been sort of on my own for the past oh, Damn. 14 years now. Damn. Sorry to hear that. No one to blame. He's I'm not gonna say that, bro. Why would I say he's homeless then? We're all homeless right now. I'm gonna leave Kenny alone right now, bro. He's going through this their stuff right now. Damn. Dan's going through it. Did you talk to him? I did. He had some, uh... He explained himself and made some good points. Look, we're not gonna let anything bad happen to you. But there are some precautions we have to take. Oh. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. How does she know that word? Sweetheart. Okay. What should we do? Well, we're gonna figure out a plan for when we get to Savannah. Teach you how to protect yourself and, uh... Tidy up a little. So you can't get grabbed so easily. I'd like that. Good. Yeah. You need to know how to protect yourself. Like hiding or running away? Got it. I mean, with one of these. First, don't be afraid of it. It's just a thing. Take it. But know where your finger is all the time. And don't put it on the trigger unless you want to hurt somebody. Okay. Yeah. See, it's not scary. It's heavy. You'll get stronger. To aim, you look right down the top through that notch. Line up the sight at the end with your target. Is there anything else I should know? When you're ready to shoot, make sure you're not breathing too hard. And then hold uh. your breath right when you pull the trigger. Like when I'm swimming? <gasps> oh, just for a quick second. I found that if I did that, it's a lot more accurate. It's tough, but it'll help. I can do that. Okay. Good. Don't lock your elbows. Okay, let's take your first shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly, and I'll cover your ears. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. <laughs> you okay? My hands hurt. I don't like this. Let's stick with it, okay? Do I have to? Yeah, you do. I don't even know what hell she's aiming at. Bit to the right. Aim higher. A little higher. Oh, shit. I got it. Excellent. Good shot. I think it was 
was that easy. So I'm aiming her gun from all the way down here to the side. I can't even see. All right, left. Okay. Aim a little bit more to the left. And lower. Lower. There it is. There you go. Nice. Yeah, you did. Good job. I was holding my breath, and the gun didn't shake so much. See, you did good. Oh, she's yeah, learning that quick. Too. No, far from it. But you know how these things work now. We'll graduate you to walkers one day. Okay. Yep. Feel good. Not so scary, huh? No. -uh. That's good. Isn't chamber or the thing supposed to be high after you shoot it? Damn straight, we taught her. Nothing. We have to talk about your hair. It's not safe. That's not nice. What? Are you saying it smells? Nah. Because it does, kinda. Do you remember when Andy St. John grabbed it and I got mad? Yeah. Well, that could happen again. And if it's a walker, well, we need to trim it. Just a trim, right? I need to cut it short enough so that it can't get grabbed. Okay. I don't know how short that is. But glad if we do this now. I guess not. Don't mow. It's a good thing. I don't know what I'm you doing. Know how to do this? Yeah, of course. I don't believe you. Okay. That's well, crazy. Good. good? Means you know when someone's lying to you, which is another valuable survival skill. So you did kill someone before. I mean, the bottom of her hair looks way heavier than the top of it. Me too. You've killed lots of things now. It doesn't even matter. Okay, that's one way to think about it. Oh, her hair kind of looks like, not mine. Mine's a little curlier, but... different how do you do it now to protect yourself and to protect me yeah i was sent to jail so i guess i don't know how curly your hair is it's all the time quality yeah. so i can't really tell i'm about done i can probably tie these pieces back with something here i have some hair thingies you do there you go oh, yeah lily gave them to me for sleeping lily there all set i shouldn't say you try to rob her and then pop you. Oh crap, she's Does set. Look dumb. <laughs> no. Hell no. You look cute. And a lot harder to grab. That's nice. Oh, she's sad about a haircut. Her is a lot safer. We gotta have another chat. I'm sorry about your hair. I think it looks cute though. That's My nice. Mom isn't going to like it. What a crappy day. The crappiest. Yep. Three months ago, I'd known what you'd be seeing. I don't know if I would have taken you with me. I probably would have run out of food. You damn near starved with me. I'm glad I came with you. Yeah. What do you think about Chuck? I don't know. The strange one, huh? Might be an okay guy, though. You think? We'll keep an open mind probably had it pretty rough what do you think about Chuck? I already asked that come on man me neither he <sighs> might be an okay guy though you think we'll keep an open mind about him he's probably had it pretty rough jeez I'll be right back okay damn I wish I got those graham crackers for <laughs> it's a fifth of whiskey a fifth And you good, man? Hey, Ben. 
Hey. Carly didn't have to die, you know. She would have killed me instead. Yeah, maybe. Aren't many of us left. Yeah. Uh. You, me, and Kenny. Clementine. The homeless dude if he sticks around. Four. Are you gonna be able to step up? I can do just as much as anyone else. Good. That's good. I hope that's true. See ya. Yeah. I don't know if you can... <sighs> He's tied down there with Clementine right now. Power rankings, I got Lee. Above Kenny, though. For sure. Mind if I get by you for a second, Kenny? Can you just leave me alone? Alright. Hey. Hey. It'll be good to get to the water. You still want to get a boat? It's still the best plan. Yeah. All right. The best plan. All right. You mind if I look in there for a second? I really wish you'd just leave me alone. Okay, jackass. I don't know what this attitude's for. I found this if you want it. Realize I had it left. Thank you. Want a nip? <sighs> no, I'm no, fine. I'm gotta fine. gotta be ten toes down. Damn. Hmm. Anybody in there want to share a drink? You let them know. Will do. I think I know someone that might. So I'll go. I'll go tell them. Chuck wanted to know if you needed a drink. He's got some. Yeah. Yeah, that'd help. Okay. You get up out of here now. Thanks. No problem. Ben looks Ben you look stressed out. See you. Oh, okay. Damn, he can't get a drink yet. It was me. What? I was the one giving the bandits surprise. Oh god. Why would he make a trade though without no one else knowing? He could have told us at least so we could have known. He just now decides to say it. What for? Why the hell would you do this? They said they had my friend. That he was with them. Like Who's his friend? Realized they didn't. It was too late. They said they'd kill me. Kill all of us. I'm sorry, Lee. I guess it's all right now. It's not like we can do anything about it. All right, let's go show Clementine this map. Talk about Savannah. Me too. And what we're gonna do when we get there. We don't know what to expect. The city could be bad or totally under control. The thing is, you and I, we're a team, you know? And a team needs a plan. Yeah. Aside from everyone else, when this train stops, you and I should know exactly what we're doing. A plan. I like it. <laughs> yeah. Good. I think we should look for your parents. Really? Yeah. You need to know if they're okay. And, well, if they're not, what happened to them? I'm sure they're okay. I bet they are too. Yeah, it's Why nice would I say I think I heard them die? Dad always says. Let's look at the map. If we can figure out where they were, we can start there. Looks like we'll come right through town if there's nothing on the tracks to hold us up. Got a good chunk of Savannah here. What do you think? They always stay in the same place when they go there. It's, uh, hmm. Hey, you got it. Don't worry. We'll figure it out. Have you ever been there? Once. Well, think about it. A lot of 
hotels on here, but read this map and maybe it'll jog your memory. They've got really tasty desserts. It's called the M... M... something... Mar... Is this it? The Marsh House? Yes, that's it! So we'll head there. Uh -huh. Yes! You think we have a good plan? I think it's very good. Alright, that's nice. Can I tell my parents? You know... You know what? I'm a killer? Wait, I don't know if that's what she think. I don't we have a plan. Maybe it's something else. Good little chef. Thanks. I guess we should see how far. Oh shit! Hold on, everybody! The damn train broke. Oh, that plan was short lived. He looks pissed. Oh yeah, we would have died. Fuck, 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 fuck! How the hell walk? That's fucking stupid, Ben. Okay. Just saying. Damn. Hmm, I don't know. I ain't got much experience with y'all's fortitude, but we could probably deal with that. We got a goddamn train. That thing's not full of milk, Charles. That's gas or diesel. Something that's going to explode. You got to get a hold of yourself. There's a crew here. Oh, they're drunk. I forgot. This ain't shit. This. Yo, you keep screaming like that and you're going to get your face chewed off. Are you guys going to be trouble? Because we could have just kept walking. <laughs> no, we're friendly. Put your hand down, kid. That's what everybody says. We know. Let's give these guys a break. We'll see. You guys got a problem with your train? Yeah. You're They're in the walking right ditch, so I remember Dude, them, I think. It's a wreck. It's not so bad from up here. Send your buddy up to have a look. Anything goes sideways up there, we won't let them escape. Should have sent Ben up. I don't know why I'm going up. If I come up there, you better not be murderers or thieves. I guess you'll have to find out. Oh, hell no. A group of guys is what we need. They're what you think we need. We're doing fine. For now. What about when... Stop it. Hey, dude. I'm Omid. Lee. Krista. What's the deal with the train? We're driving it. Oh, man. You want to help us out? We could use some able bodies and yeah, we we really need some help. What's in it? Oh shit. Oh shit, Clements, I know fall. You guys have a kid. What are you doing up here? Do you know how long it's been since I've seen a kid? Shit. What's your name? Clementine. Oh, so he gets to swear. Well, this is great. See? Things are looking up. You're not her dad. He down there? It's that obvious. To me. And no, he's not down there. Huh. What's your story? I came across Clementine alone. First day all of this happened. We've been together ever since. And everybody down there, they're cool? Yeah. Kenny lost his wife and kid. Man, how long ago? What Today? time is it? Uh, I don't know. Uh, four? Maybe two hours ago. God damn. <laughs> We're sorry for anything that's happened to you guys. The train is awesome, though. A tank is your real problem. We'll help you with it. But if we see anything we don't like, we're moving on down the road. Alone. That's fine. We'd appreciate the help. We can't just blast through it, I guess? If you could get it down, the rest would probably be pretty easy. We'll start there. We'll come down and settle in and see if we can help. All right, man. It's in here. All right, all right. That's for later. That's for later. All right, well, anyways, that's gonna be in the end of this part. Damn, I've been recording straight thirty minute videos. Yeah, it's gonna be the end of this one. If y'all like the video, like, comment, subscribe, so I can know to keep posting these videos. And 
after this series over, I'm gonna start playing scary games again. I just needed a break. But yeah, scary videos are next after this game. Alright, yeah. Peace. Have a good day, y'all.